Hello, it's Josh from Feed Your Zebra and this is the first part of a new series we're making of Zebra Designer Tutorials. Um, we'll be looking at some stuff such as designing labels and barcodes, uh, what uh, some of the different barcodes do because there's quite a few options and you know I can understand if it's quite confusing for someone that's maybe not used the software before or you know doesn't necessarily have extensive knowledge of barcoding systems and uh, some other cool stuff that you can do like um, in Zebra Design Pro you can import data from spreadsheets and uh, just some frequently asked questions we get I'll be covering some of them but um, yeah in this episode I will be looking at installing Zebra Designer you can uh, download it from Zebra's website but you need an account it is free to set up but for the purpose of this video I am going to download it directly from our website feedyourzebra.co.uk so we're going to click on downloads I'm then going to go to software and uh, click this link here I'm going to save the executable and yeah I'm just going to wait a moment for that to download but um, yeah it's, so yeah as I was saying it is free to download off um, Zebra's website but you need to create an account with them and it is a little bit time consuming so um, yeah it is available without any effort off our website and uh, yeah if you need any consumables for your zebra printer be it ribbons labels print heads then uh, make sure to check out the site got a uh, yeah pretty comprehensive choice of all the consumables you can possibly want and yeah the download is done i'll get rid of that sorry um okay so we're going to run this, press yes, just give it a moment to do this. Yeah, this is the free version of Zebra Design. There is, as I did mention briefly earlier, um, a version called Zebra Designer Pro, which gives you some slightly more powerful tools such as being able to import data from other sources. But um, for now, and you know, for most people, I think uh, Zebra Designer 2 should suffice. Okay, um, right, okay, this is this licensing service. We need to install that. It um, should be fine. Fine. Okay, so my name is Josh, and the company is Feed Your Zebra. So press next. And uh, yeah, it's fine. Uh, yeah, and uh, why not, right? All the icons, right? Yeah, I'll just give this a moment to install. But um, yeah, in the next video, I will be looking at creating uh, a label from scratch, and I'll be going over some of the more basic features, such as adding text boxes, uh, manipulating them, and uh, setting up the boundaries of the label on the uh, in Zebra Designer because obviously you don't want to go over and uh, yeah I'm just going to have some more basic features and yeah there we go run easy right okay well um, yeah if you found that hope uh, hope helpful even um, yeah please uh, drop us a like maybe comment or uh, if you want to see more videos in the series then subscribe uh, thanks for watching